what's cracking everybody it's uh, November 22nd 2019 in the Big Bear Lake California area we are headed towards Bear Mountain right now um, got to tell you guys something pretty darn cool so just give me a second when we get to Bear I will tell you guys okay so we're getting a little bit closer but I just wanted to do another little short clip just so you guys can see how much snow still left up here it's not it's not too much but I mean it's, it's still gorgeous anyway I'll be right here at Bear in just a moment give me a second all right, you guys. So we are here at Bear. This is where I used to work, right in there in the kitchen. And then on the weekends, I'd be up here at the barbecue cooking up here. It was so awesome. We'd get to see all the concerts and um, all the snowboard competitions and stuff just right here. Just awesome. Very, very awesome. So uh, yeah, I miss it. So anyway, what I wanted to tell you guys is, uh, um, We've got possible record-breaking snow coming next week. And this is the uh, first time I've done a video like this, this early, about letting you guys know to be very prepared. Um, this could be something that could shut the valley down. <laughs> I'm serious. Meaning that, like, uh, um, we've had such big storms up here where there's no way in or out of town. And to bring in food and water, they have to bring it in by chopper for a few days. So I'm kind of hoping that that situation happens up here. Imagine being able to drive around town with nobody here. Just three, four feet of snow. So anyway, next week, Wednesday, um, we are supposed to begin the onslaught of storms. And as I was telling everybody, my theory is that we are going to get a lot more snow this year. Not more precipitation, but more snow because we had a much cooler than, than average summertime. And I believe that's going to translate into a cooler than average winter, which means that some of our storms that are right on the snow line, you know, when it comes to the atmospheric river, I believe that those storms are going to be snow and therefore we're going to get absolutely smashed. And that's what's going to happen this next week. So I'm hoping temps stay cool and we end up getting blasted. Um, ah, I really, really, really hope so. So next Tuesday night, it's, it's, it's supposed to start. We could get three to six inches next Tuesday night. And then here's where it gets really good though. Or no, Wednesday night. And then uh, Thanksgiving day, we could get a foot of snow just during the, the early part of the day. And then at nighttime, a foot plus again during the night. So maybe two plus feet of snow just in the one day. This time lapse is gonna be insane. We're gonna have a great time doing this. Uh, my mom's coming up here to visit on Monday to stay and, she, and she's gonna stay through, through Thanksgiving. Um, I'm so, so blessed and so grateful. Guys, that's what six and a half years sober off of alcohol will do you'll you know if 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 life is just miserable because you're still in the midst of your alcoholism trust me man you, you can get everything back you can get your family back your loved ones back into your life just 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 love yourselves enough to just quit that stuff uh, because i love you guys enough and i know you guys can if i can you can i was considered the hopeless variety of alcoholic but anyway so yeah so um yeah eight to twelve inches thursday eight to 12 inches Thursday night or more. And then Friday morning, another six inches potentially. Um, and Friday night we could get a little bit more. And as I said, if uh, <laughs> this event could be astronomical for us up here, because if the atmospheric river, um, if that subtropical moisture comes up here and we're in a much cooler type of, um, you know, a climate this time, um, <laughs> that, that rain is gonna be snow and we're gonna get mammoth mountain sized snowstorms um, next week. It's gonna be absolutely insane. We are so, so, so hoping and bracing for it. But I wanted you guys to know that we could get all that snow. So just be very prepared, be very prepared. I don't want you guys to get stuck or have any issues. It's really important that you heed this advice when you come up here this, this next week. Um, please come up here Tuesday or earlier so you don't get stuck and make sure you have a lot of warm clothes and blankets in your car and food and water um, and let two or three different people know exactly where you're going and what time they should expect to hear from you. It's really important guys. I'm not joking. This is going to be a massive system. Absolutely massive. Um, <laughs> now watch it doesn't even pan out at all, but um, no, it's, it's looking pretty gnarly and, and both of the, uh, the major weather models are, are falling into agreement now, the Euro and ours. So, Guys, this could be fantastic. This could be fantastic. Let's just uh, keep our fingers crossed. 
because I'm telling you right now, we could get snow higher than these benches right here. Oh my gosh, that would just be incredible. Anyway, I love you guys a lot. And um, anything I can do for you guys, just let me know. Just let me know. Any questions you have, please don't hesitate to ask. I'm here for you guys. I want you guys to be safe and I want you guys to come up here and have a great time. Um, you know, none of us get to live here if, it's, if, if it isn't for you guys coming up here, having a good time and, and you know, contributing to the economy up here. So thank you. You guys freaking rock big time. And yeah, anyway, I love you guys a lot. As I said, this is a, a warning video um, days in advance. Obviously, we're going to do the calm before the storm video on Tuesday, probably. Um, but this is going to be possibly a record breaker, you guys, in terms of the amount of snow. So let's keep our fingers crossed. That would be fantastic. Love you guys. Love you guys. Thank you. Bye.